Hi everyone, I am Ujwal and you are watching Geek Yorker. In this video, I am going to show you how you can use phone app on your Mac in Mac OS Tahoe 26. This app lets you make and receive phone calls on your Mac using your iPhone. You don't need to touch your iPhone anymore and I promise you that you won't need to watch any other video on the internet. In this video, I am going to let you know everything you need to know about phone app on your Mac. So before we start using the phone app, let's talk about the requirement you need. So the first requirement is your Mac must be updated to Mac OS Tahoe 26 and your iPhone should be on iOS 26. The another requirement, both the devices must be use same Apple ID and they should be connected with the same Wi-Fi network. Okay, so these are the major requirements. Apart from this, you must check some initial settings. So the first setting is on your iPhone. So open your iPhone and then go to settings. Now here scroll down all the way and click on apps. Here scroll and find phone app and then click on it. Here scroll down until you find calls category. Now in calls category you can see this option calls on other devices. Click on it and make sure you have enabled the toggle right to allow calls on other devices and if your MacBook is showing make sure to enable the toggle right to it so that's about the first setting now the second setting is on your mac so click on the apple logo at the top left corner of the screen and then choose system settings after that make sure you are in general and then in the right side pan click on airdrop and handoff now make sure now make sure to enable the toggle right to allow handoff between this mac and your icloud devices so that's about the requirements and review the initial settings that you need to change if not. Now your Mac is ready to use phone app. So open phone app from spotlight search or directly from your dock. As soon as you open it, you will see your recent list. And when you click on any contact, you will see their full profile on the right. As you can see here, the interface looks very similar to iPhone phone app. On the left side pan, you will see all the voice calls, FaceTime, missed calls and answered calls. And when you click on any contact, then on the right side, you will see the selected contact card with their photo and name if you save and action buttons. You can message, call or FaceTime them directly by clicking on the icons below their name. It also show call history, voicemail and shared contact posters. If you click on the filter icon, you will be prompted by a pop-up with call, missed, voicemail and, and spam options. If you want to see how many missed calls you have then you can directly click on missed if you want to see the voicemail then you can click on voicemail so basically you have different filters here now if you want to make a call to someone by dialing their number then you can click on keypad icon it opens a dialer where you can manually dial a number and once done you can click on this green call button now if you want to delete a call entry just take your cursor to the contact and then swipe right all the way so this way you can delete a recent call entry now you can also add a favorite contact by clicking on this edit button and then you can click on add favorite and now from here you can scroll down and then choose the contact that you want to add to favorite and then follow the on-screen instructions i'll make a separate video for that and then add the video link in the description so you can go and watch that video so that's all about this one. If this video helps you in any way, then do like it and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.